Many users find themselves hitting Claude's usage limits faster than they expect. But what if you could double the amount of usage available to you during a single working session without having to upgrade your plan or use any APIs? Well, you can. And the best part, it's surprisingly simple. Let me show you how. Okay, before we can dive into the method, and I promise to be quick, we need to take a short detour to understand how Claude actually calculates usage limits. Because once you understand that, you can use it to your advantage and start getting twice the value from your subscription. So Claude calculates usage limits a bit differently than tools like ChatGPT. Instead of giving you a fixed number of messages per week or per month, Claude uses a session-based system. Here's how it works. Each session lasts five hours and starts the moment you send your first message. During that five hour session, you are limited to a set number of messages based on your plan. Once you reach that limit, you won't be able to use Claude again until the five hour window resets. On the free plan, you get around 10 messages per session. On a $20 pro plan, you get about 45 messages. And on a $100 max plan, you get around 225 messages. After five hours, your session resets and so does your usage limits. That's really all you need to know for now on how Claude calculates usage. And if you're more interested in the details, I made a separate video that deep dives into this. I'll link it in the description below. Okay, now that we understand how Claude calculates sessions limits, let's talk about how to use that to our advantage. The key is all about timing your sessions. Let me show you what I mean with a example. Let's say it's Saturday and you set aside the afternoon to work on your new app idea using Claude. You wake up around nine, grab a coffee, walk the dog, and eventually start working at 1 p.m. At that point, you log into Claude and start collaborating, coding, and chatting back and forth. Since a session is a five hour time frame, that means this session runs from 1 p.m. to 6 p.m. Now, let's say you're working pretty intensively and by 3 p.m., after a lot of back and forth with Claude, you get the dreaded one message remaining pop-up. Well, that's it. You reach your usage cap and Claude won't let you continue until 6 p.m. when your session and your usage limits reset. So now, you have three hours of forced downtime, and that can be really frustrating. How can you avoid this situation? Sure, you can upgrade your plan or use the API, but is there a smarter way and a way that doesn't require spending more money? Yes, there is. And it just takes a little bit of strategic planning. Let's take a look at that timeline again. You already know you plan to start working with Claude at 1 p.m. and you know a session begins the moment you send your first message. So here's what you do instead. At around 10 a.m., before walking the dog or starting the day, just log into Claude and send a quick message. A simple hi will do. That's it. You have now started session number one at 10 a.m. and which runs until 3 p.m., but you're not actively using it yet. Then, when you actually sit down at 1 p.m. to begin your real work, you're still within that first session, and you have got two full hours of usage left. And here's where it gets even better. At 3 p.m., your session one ends, but you are eligible to begin another session right away. So if you still want to continue working, you can immediately start a new session with all your session limits restored. You can adjust the timing of session one depending on how much usage you expect. For example, if you tend to hit the limit in just one hour, you might start session one at 9 a.m. because then you get one hour of overlap from 1 p.m. to 2 p.m. before you can start another session. But if you think it will last you for four hours, maybe start at 12 o'clock. Just plan it based on how intensively you expect to use Claude that day. By starting your session earlier, even with a quick high, you shift the restart window in your favor. This allows you to overlap two full sessions during your actual working time, effectively doubling your usage limits for the day. It's a small timing adjustment, but it gives you a big advantage especially when you want to stay focused and work uninterrupted for long periods of time. Now, just a quick heads up. Depending on which Claude plan you're using, if you're on the free or the $20 pro plan, there are currently no monthly limits on the number of sessions you can start. So this method is a great way to get more value out of your subscription. 
However, if you're on the $100 max plan, Claude limits you to 50 sessions per month. So while this method still works, you'll want to be a bit more strategic on how often you want to overlap those sessions. I hope you found this helpful. If you have any questions, feel free to leave a comment. Thank you very much and look forward to chatting with you all in the next video.